नमस्कार यू आर वॉचिंग गुड मॉर्निंग आलन ही आर आर द टॉप सिक्स अपडेट्स फ्रॉम द वर्ल्ड ऑफ साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी फॉर दिस वीक 50 इयर्स अगो अ बलून सर्कम नेविगेटेड द वर्ल्ड फॉर साइंस साइंटिस्ट रिकवर्ड फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम अ बलून साइंटिफिक पे लोड आफ्टर अ लॉन्ग ड्यूरेशन ट्वाइस अराउंड द वर्ल्ड फ्लाइट द प्रोजेक्ट इज कॉल्ड बुमरैंग एंड इज डिजाइन टू डेमोन्स्ट्रेट द फिजिबिलिटी ऑफ यूजिंग बलून्स फॉर अ लॉन्ग ड्यूरेशन रिसर्च साइंस में दशकों से बलून्स का उपयोग किया जाता रहा है फॉर इंस्टेंस डेटा कलेक्टेड बाय बलून्स हैव हेल्प्ड रिवील दैट द यूनिवर्स इज जियोमेट्रिकली फ्लैट दैट अर्थ स्लोअर एटमोसफेयर इज राइजिंग ड्यू टू क्लाइमेट चेंज एंड हाउ वाइल्ड फायर स्मोक इम्पैक्ट द ओजोन लेयर ए आई बेस्ड मेथड टू इम्प्रूव लंग सिटी स्कैन रीडिंग द इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी आई आई टी इंदौर हैज कोलेबोरेटेड विद एन इंदौर बेस्ड हॉस्पिटल and a medical college in odisha to develop an artificial intelligence based method to read lung ct scan ground glass opacity with more than 90% accuracy the researchers used a 2d unit based deep learning approach to develop 2d images to segment the lungs and detect ground glass opacity in specific lobes iit mandi researchers develop an affordable way to produce metal oxide layers for solar cells researchers at the indian institute of technology mandi have made a significant breakthrough in the development of metal oxide layers for use in advanced architecture silicon solar cells india currently has a manufacturing capacity of 3 gigawatts for solar cells and 15 gigawatts for modules however the government plans to create additional domestic solar equipment manufacturing capacity of 25 gigawatts each of solar cells and modules and 10 gigawatts of wafers by april 2023 doing research such as this for india solar industry indian origin robotics engineer to head nasa's newly established moon to mars program amit chatriya an indian american engineer with expertise in software and robotics has been appointed as the inaugural head of NASA's newly established Moon to Mars program. This program has been created to establish a long-term presence on the moon, which is crucial for preparing for future missions to Mars. Shatriya will serve as a NASA's first head of the office with immediate effect. He will immediately assume the role of leading the office, overseeing the agency's human exploration activities. on the moon and mars skyroot aerospace test fires advanced fully 3d printed cryogenic engine skyroot aerospace a startup based in hyderabad india has successfully test fired an advanced fully 3d printed cryogenic engine named dhruvastra marking a significant milestone in the country's indigenous space technology development the use of 3d printing technology allowed for greater precision in the engine's design and fabrication resulting in highly efficient and powerful rocket engine Kerala State Inland Navigation Corporation has launched India's first solar powered tourist boat The boat is called Suryamshu which can produce 27 kilowatts of energy The boat also has generators which will help power passenger lift systems and air conditioners The solar panels will provide about 75% of vessel's energy needs while the rest will be met by the generators. So, these were the top updates for this week. Have a good day.